everyone. I'm back with another unboxing. So excited to get this. I am not going to tell you who it's from. Can you guess who it's from? Who's it from? Who's it from? Who's it from? It's from my favorite diamond painting company in the world. You all don't know me all that well yet, so you don't know who that is. But you will find out in one hot second. It is da -la 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 -lum. That's right. It's my Diamond Art Club. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This was one of their new releases last Saturday. And I am so glad that I did not wait and I snagged this up right away when it came onto the site for the um, VIP access because it did sell out. So as of right now, this image is sold out on their site. But because it's a new release and not too many people have it yet, I am gonna show it off. So here it is. What did I get? I got the Wildflowers Butterflies. Wild, yeah, wide, Wildflowers Butterflies. That's kind of a mouthful, isn't it? Wildflowers Butterflies. Whatever, I can talk sometimes. Sometimes I can speak. So, this is a uh, diamond painting. The artist says on here is Gina Jane. Gina Jones. I can't see. I don't have my glasses on, you guys. Gina Jane. And the dimensions are 84 by 56. Wow, did I know it was that big when I ordered it? No, I didn't. I just saw the image and I just knew that I had to have it. We are thinking spring here. Thinking spring, thinking summer. I knew I had to have it. And it came. It got here today. It's Thursday and I ordered it on Saturday morning. So not too bad for shipping time. Everything seems to be a little slowed up this week. That things I've been expecting to get on a certain day I haven't gotten until a day or two after I thought I would get them. So let's, without further ado, let's get right into this kit. It is a round kit. For anybody who doesn't know, Diamond Art Club always packages in these nice boxes so your kits never arrive damaged. And like you saw, it not only comes in this box, but it also comes in another box so that um, you're guaranteed that your kit's going to arrive safely. Never had anything arrive even slightly uh, uh, damaged from Diamond Art Club. So inside the box, what have we got? We have our inventory sheet our um, labels and they have recently gone to um, pre-scoring these labels for you so that you can kit up your um, storage containers which is <sighs> to me it's a double-edged sword In one way it's nice I mean it's a great concept I love the concept but one of the last orders that I or yeah one of the orders that I got where this had done because this gets folded up a little bit inside the box they were, they were kind of peeled off in stuck places where they shouldn't have been stuck. And so I had to kind of carefully take them out. And it wasn't a kit that I planned on doing um, in the near future. So I kind of had to just really baby it and try to get it back on there and then store it someplace where it wasn't going to get shuffled around a lot. But they do give you this um, um, with your sticker labels for your containers. A big picture, you can write in the start date and the end date. I also put this on my container so I know what is in that container. Um, and then a, an image of the diamond painting. And that is what it looks like. We're going to get into the kit itself and see exactly what the drill field looks like. But that's what the painting is going to look like. Isn't it nice? I love it. I love Black Eyed Susans are one of my favorite flowers. Daisies, another favorite. And these are um, purple cone flowers, I believe. I know they don't look purple, but I believe those are cone flowers. Just by the, I can, just by the way that the, the center is and the way the um, petals are hanging down. And then you've got some butterflies in there. Um, and we here in Michigan, we, I, we have a lot of monarchs. Monarchs come here to, um, uh, reproduce. They do their chrysalis thing and, um, 
and, and it's always fun to watch. Um, milkweed, um, if you find um, milkweed, that's where they, that's where they uh, lay their eggs and that's where you can find uh, monarch caterpillars. Boy, I'm saying ah, ah, ah a lot today, aren't I? How annoying. I wouldn't watch me. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> then you get another sticker that has a picture of your image. You can put this in your log book or on the end of your box if you're storing your box long ways and you want to identify it. Get your toolkit, which is a basic Diamond Art Club toolkit. We'll take a look at it just in case anyone's not familiar with Diamond Art Club. And because this is a newer release, maybe somebody will be watching this video that hasn't purchased from them before. So in your standard toolkit from Diamond Art Club, you get two plates of heart-shaped wax, which this is better than your average pink wax. Um, you can tell because it is opaque. You can't see through it rather than uh, translucent, which is the little square pads that you get with most of your cheaper uh, diamond paintings. Um, the more you can see through the wax, the worse quality it is. So Diamond Art Club does make good, good wax. Um, blue pen squishy and a four placer clear tray with a spout and a bunch of baggies and they give you a generous amount of baggies not going to be enough to for this kit um 54 colors this has that's a lot of colors 54 colors that's going to make those flowers really pop that's going to make that just look gorgeous you're going to see all the detail in the flowers and the foliage and the butterflies so I think it's going to turn out really nice, but let's take a look at the canvas itself. Set that off to the side. Try to do this without ripping it, but I always rip the plastic. I don't know what's wrong with me. I just, I don't have a gentle touch, I guess. Yeah, I already ripped it. Oh, well. This is going to stay out anyways. Um, I know I said... <laughs> I know last time I said I was keeping my, that painting out and kidding it up, but this one I mean it because I'm going to do this for an event. So I am keeping this out and kidding it up for sure. Diamond Art Club has the really nice tarpaulin uh, canvas. It's, it's very um, velvety soft on the back. So let's unroll this and see what we've got. Wow, those flowers are big. Can you guys see that? Wow, look at how big those flowers appear. This is beautiful, look at it. Oh, that is so nice. That is such a nice canvas. This is gonna be a joy to work on. It's gonna be so nice to work on something uplifting and bright and beautiful um, this time of year especially. Yes, oh. I love it. I love it. I do love it. And I'm definitely going to kit this up right away. have to wait to, be, to start on it, but I'm going to kit it up right away. So you get this little pamphlet with your step-by-step -step instructions. There is a coupon code on the inside. So if you want to keep and take a look at that. But let's take a look at, what should we look at first? Look at the drills first. Take a look at the drills. Like I said, there are 54 colors, so I'm not going to go through every single color. How many ABs do we have? We can tell that by taking a look at the canvas. AB colors are in, are going to be anything that's less than a 150 DMC code. So you can see up here on the on the legend we have one, two, three DMC or three AB colors, three ABs. So that's a lot. That's going to be nice. And we'll take a look at the canvas in a minute here once we get these drills open. And take a look at them and we'll see where those ABs are going to go. You know, everything about this uh, painting is sparkly and shiny. So I don't even have, I couldn't even venture a guess. And look at all of those luscious, vibrant, beautiful colors. Yes, I said luscious. That's what they are. So, ooh, I'm just going to pop them through the screen for you so you can see each one. I'm not going to read them all off. Blue, yellow, couple bags of 3865, 702. All right, maybe I lied. 996, 699, 743, 3755. Couple bags of that, 701, 890. That's a nice deep green. I like that. That's pretty. Couple bags of 3841. 
baby blue. Couple, nope, just one bag of 33.71, 700. Couple bags of 33.25. That's what we've got in our first first row. What do we got in this one? These are the smaller bags. We've got 907 P green, 823, 990. Wow, 991. I don't know if I've ever had that color before. Look at that. That's a beautiful turquoise. That's nice. I don't know if I've ever seen that. 938, 334, 433, 814, my favorite DMC color. 601, that's a pretty color. 434, 3837, 208, 312, 947, 900, 739, 126. That's one of our ABs. So is that a pink or a lavender? Let me look. I believe that's a, it's a very light lavender color. You can see the iridescent, AB means that's the iridescent coating that goes on top of the drills that makes it a little bit more uh, sparkly. 209, 135, there's another of our AB diamonds, like a pea soup green kind of color. 322 and 976. And then in our last, our last batch of colors, we've got 604 Bubblegum Pink, 741, 703, 603, 310, wow, not very much, 310, 333, 602, 3843, 445, 740, 704, 336, 605, 963, 3746, 797, 136. That is our other, our third AB diamond, and that is a deeper purple. And I love those, you guys. Look at those. Look at how those sparkle. That it seems like the AB coating was just made for this color diamond, the hues that it gives off. It's really beautiful. 498, 600, and 340. And that's all of our drills for this painting. Now let's look and see where those AB goes. ABs go, and we can take a look at the drill field for clarity. I just know because of working with Diamond Art Club that it's always going to be a clear drill field, and the canvas is going to be really just excellent to work on. Um, but just to show you guys up close in case you haven't seen... So the codes for the three ABs are numbers one, two, and three. So where do I think those are going to be? One, two, and three. I'm looking around on here. One, two, and three. Okay, here's some ones over here in this purple flower. Two was a green, wasn't it? Where are we going to find that? Oh, down here. Down here in the stems, down here in the stems of this flower, there's some of that number two. Over here in the stem on this flower by this butterfly are some number two. And number three is sprinkled over here in this, what I bet you it looks like a lilac when it's going to get diamond painted. Number three is over there. Some number threes up here in this, up here, you can't, y'all can't see that. Number threes up here in this blue butterfly. And some number threes over here on this edge on this butterfly. So, and then we've got some more number threes, no, down here in this patch of flowers. So it looks like they're going to just be sprinkled throughout, um, throughout the painting. Um, but this is going to be so... What do you guys think of it? How do you guys feel? Would you guys hang this up in your house? At least for springtime? Let me know. If you have any comments or questions or suggestions, please leave them in the comments. And thank you for watching and subscribing. Have a great day, you guys. Bye.